guys, welcome to Educating Shani. I'm Shani and I have an eating disorder. Hi Shani, hi. I'm a little bit sick today. Um, I started getting sick a few days ago and I'm still feeling it and I feel gross and yucky, but, but I need to record a video to tell you how my week was. So that's what this is. Okay, so I did not make it to church yesterday. I was just way too sick. I couldn't even film yesterday because I was so sick. Um, and But I do have some good news though. I have some really good news. <sighs> okay, I've been doing all week that's been helping me and that is praying for myself. If you watched last week's video, you know that that used to be really hard for me to do. It still is hard, but I'm trying to do it more. And yeah, it's it's been good. I've, I'm feeling a lot of strength coming from God and coming from my faith in Him and my faith in myself. So that's been really good for me. Again, if you're not religious and you don't pray, I'm not telling you you have to do it. I'm telling you that for me, it's been probably the best tool that's out there, honestly, because that's what I believe it is. Okay, so I didn't make it to church, however, gosh, my nose is all red. It looks even redder in the video. Whoa. It's a good thing I have these Cool Touch Kleenexes that Christy gave me last week. Thank you, Christy. These have been awesome. Okay, so let's get to my other goals of the week. Um, last week, I set the goal that I would go two nights this week because before that, I made it one night um, last week without binging, purging, um, restricting, over laxitizing, any of that stuff. And so I made it the, my goal this week to go two nights without binging, purging, starving, laxitize, any any eating disorder behavior. So, um, so I did not make it two days. Um, I did make it four days though. Four days. Four days this week. I went without binging and purging, without starving, without over laxitizing, without any of that. Four. I doubled it. I'm very proud of that. Just thought I'd share. I mean, I've been really trying to stay distracted from it. Like, um, like I will come, even if I don't post them, I'll just come and make a video to distract me from binging and purging. Um, or, you know, I try and do things for people. So, I don't know if you, if I said this about me, I don't know. Um, I make cards for people, that's what I do, that's what this, whole desking area is about is because I'm a crafter I guess and um, I love making cards for people that's what I do I make cards for women in my church I make cards for people randomly and lately I've been using that as a crutch I've been coming out here outside of my bedroom get away from my room I've been making cards for people sending mailing people random cards just saying that I'm thinking about them so you might actually get one if you're watching this I don't know if you're one of those people but actually if you're watching this go leave in the comments below your address because I might just want to send you a card one day and that would help me that would really really help me out a lot so I've just really been trying to stay distracted and um, I feel like I'm getting better like I feel like I'm not like I'm sick right now <laughs> with a cold but I feel like I'm getting like um, Excuse me, I had a bunch of phlegm coming up. I really should go lay down, I'm not feeling well. I'm gonna keep going and see how my week goes this week. I'm gonna um, just keep the same goals and maybe I will double the goals again, who knows, let's see. And um, I'm really just starting to learn how to rely on the sources that I need to rely on rather than, rather than my eating disorder. I'm relying on God, number one. I'm relying on my husband. I'm relying on my mom who's been an angel in my life. And I'm relying on all of you guys out there, everybody who uplifts me every single day. I get some sort of uplifting message or email or text or something. Every single day I get at least one or two of them. And that just uplifts me more and it makes me want to keep going and to get better more. So um, yeah, so if you're out there and you're watching and you have an eating disorder, I would suggest Finding a distraction for yourself. Find something else that you can do um, in order to distract yourself from wanting to binge and purge or starve or over-exercise or over-laxitize or anything like that. So 
yeah so anyway so that's my tip for the week and I will see you on Tuesday for another Topic Tuesday video and hopefully I will feel better keep on watching for my shout out video it is coming I promise it's coming it's just that I have so many people to thank and so many people to give shout outs to that I want to like take my time and make sure I get everybody and make sure I say everything I want to say to you I might have to kind of simplify it a little bit more than what I've been doing because each each thank you is like 10 minutes long not really but like five minutes long each seriously so I'm trying to figure out a way to do that quicker so we'll see anyway I'm working on it so keep your eye out for that go follow me on Facebook at educating Shani and Instagram at educating Shani and keep on watching my videos and I'll see you on Tuesday for another topic and I love you and thank you for supporting me and you're really wonderful and my NyQuil is kicking in and I need to go lay down because I'm not feeling very good and um, I just don't feel good so thank you for watching you're beautiful you're worth it and I am too thanks for watching bye